Welcome, Welcome to, to the Roar, your source for all of Milton Middle School news. I'm Danny, this guy's East Up. I'm East Up. And now, to Maya and Trenton for an update on the kickball bracket. Hey guys, this is where the kickball bracket stands at as of today, November 1st. So far at the number one seed, we have Miss Barry's homeroom. The two seeded is Webb's homeroom. Three seed is Hayes' homeroom. Recently, the fourth seeded Miss Watson's homeroom and the fifth seeded Miss Hess's homeroom played each other with Watson coming victorious. Miss Hess is now in the loser's bracket. Moving on to 6B, we have seeded first is Mr. Call's homeroom. Second is Miss Gues, then Miss Terman's homeroom. Latif and Miss Summers have not played each other yet, so nobody's in the loser's bracket. Over here, we have 7A, with Miss Childers being your number one seed, Miss Barr being your two seed, Arvon at the three seed, and Farrell and Queen were the four and fifth seed, with Queen coming uh, coming up with the win. Miss Feller is now in the loser, loser's bracket. And then we have 7B. We have Miss Black is number one standing as her homeroom team for kickball. Colgrove seed second, and the Miss Dillo seated three. Wood and Eastman have not played each other yet, so there's no loser's bracket. Over here, we have the 8A bracket with number one seed being Miss Dilly's homeroom, the two seed being Mr. Atkins homeroom, three seed being Miss Fowler's homeroom, four seed Miss, Mr. Casto's homeroom, and the fifth seed is Keaton's homeroom. Keaton recently beat Mr. Casto, so Mr. Casto is now in the loser's bracket. Then we have 8B. Seat at number one is Miss Macon's homeroom. Yeah. Then Mr. Good's homeroom. That's my homeroom. We're, we're just good like that. Then we have Miss Jones and then Matthews as fourth seat and Miss Steele is last. So far they have not played, so there's no losers bracket. And go Miss Macon's homeroom. Go Mr. Good. No. You guys will lose. No. Thank you, Maya and Trent. And good luck to you all. Now it's on the pumpkins. In the 8th grade hallway, the Carilla classrooms have been covering pumpkins to display at the Pumpkin House in Canova. Here's what some of the students and teachers have had to say. On your kickball games. It's off. Miss Fowler, why did you choose to do the pumpkin project? The pumpkin project is something fun to do with the kids out in the greenhouse. We can scoop the goop one day and then we carve the next take them out to the pumpkin house in Canova. Um, I'm very competitive, so I like being in the competition to see if, who can get the most pumpkins, but we are able to use this in our engineering. Um, so the kids are engineering their designs for the pumpkins. And what was your favorite part about the project? Being outside in the greenhouse with the kids. It's just something outside of the classroom and it's a lot of fun. Ms. Matthews, why did you choose this project? So I picked this project because we are in this engineering unit right now, and so I thought it'd be fun for the students to be able to design pumpkins and to be able to create them themselves, but also to work with the community, with the pumpkin house and the pumpkin festival. So it was just community outreach project, basically. And what was your favorite part about it? My favorite part was being able to go out in the greenhouse for two days, being able to do something fun that was hands-on, but also to get outside of the classroom and to also go to the pumpkin house with the students afterwards. So Max, what was your favorite part about the pumpkin project? Everything. And what did you like about the pumpkin project? Guts. Did you enjoy scooping the goop? Absolutely. So Connor, what was your favorite part about the pumpkin project? Probably scooping the goop. And what did you like about the pumpkin project? Scooping the goop. What did you guys like about the pumpkin project? Um, scooping out the goop. Being with my friends. What was your favorite part? Um, like, going to the house and seeing them, I guess, I don't know. Scooping the goop. <laughs> what was your favorite part about the pumpkin project? Probably scooping them. And what did you like about the pumpkin project? Carving them. What was your favorite part about the pumpkin project? Probably scooping the goop. And what did you like about the pumpkin project? Probably carving. Thank you. What did you like about the pumpkin project? Uh, just scooping out all the guts and picking apart the seeds. Ripping out guts. What did you like about the pumpkin project? The pumpkin project, uh, my favorite part about it was the carving. What was your favorite part about the pumpkin project? Scooping the goop. 
What was your favorite part about the pumpkin project? Uh, trying to carve a pumpkin that actually looked good. So right, welcome uh, to the pumpkin house in Canova, West Virginia. <laughs> These are the kids that decided to <laughs> unload all the pumpkins that we brought. <laughs> Milton Middle ended up with 246 pumpkins. What would you guys like to say about that? Uh, wow. Crazy! <laughs> <laughs> and now, Flavor Fanatics. What is up, all you people? Welcome to Flavor Fanatics. This week, we tricked a bunch of kids into them giving us their treats. And we're going to use their Halloween candy to test our taste buds. Yeah. Flavor Fanatics! Flavor Fanatics! Flavor Fanatics! Flavor Fanatics! Now let's bring out the candy. But first, no cheating. Oh yeah, that's right. All right guys, Olivia's gonna bring out uh, different candies, Halloween candies. Most of them are gonna be some form of chocolate. Um, and you're gonna try and figure out what it is. So Olivia, go ahead. Okay. Wait, how many are there? I don't know. I don't. I, I don't know either. Where are you? And you got about. I'm gonna once you once you first bite. I'm gonna give you about 15 seconds. Oh, I haven't even tried yet. Mm. I already know what that is. Hmm. Oh, that's easy. Go ahead. Like, go ahead and answer. Yeah. It's Hershey's. Mm-hmm. Not Hershey's. Okay. Are you positive? Mm-hmm. I'm pretty positive. All right, you are correct. It is a Hershey. Hershey bar. Woo. Second best chocolate. Actually, third. What was the first? First is Three Musketeers, second's Kit Kat. Treat number two. Treat number two. There it is. No. Oh, easy. Oh, yeah. Mm hmm. That's Reese's. I don't even know what this is. That's Reese's, and is that it? Yeah, that's Reese's. Definitely. Well, you were, you were second guessing yourself there. Bonus point for. Oh, I know. It's an Easter egg. It's the Easter egg. No, it's the egg. Just the egg. I'm afraid it is the pumpkin. Oh. They make pumpkin Reese's? Yeah. Yeah. All right, guys. Here's your next mm. one. Here's flavor number three. What is that? Oh. I don't mm. know. Do you know what that is, Aiden? Because I do, and I don't want to answer first, because then you'll copy me. Well, what if you... That's a Snickers. It? Snickers. Snickers. Mm -hmm. Snickers. I was kind of hoping he got that wrong. Here is I mean, flavor Snickers. Number four. Five. Four or five. Four. All right, here you go. What the? Oh, that I know what that is. That's a Whopper. Yeah, that's definitely a Whopper. Oh man, we can't trick you. Are you that's sure? correct. It was a Whopper. I got that first. That tastes fruity. It does. Actually, it does taste kind of fruity. Here's flavor number five or six. Mm. Next flavor. Mmm. I have no idea. Uh -oh. That's that's a three musketeer. Aiden. Mm. That's three musketeer. Olivia, what is that? It is a Milky Way. No, oh. I've never had Milky Way. Me neither. How was I supposed to get that? I don't know. We thought you knew. We thought you had good taste buds. We thought you were experts. That's one wrong. I don't like. That's how we so you were both it. wrong. I've so never. You're still, you're still tied. But I've never had a Milky Way. He copied me, by the way. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, you did. I said the same thing with you. Your next flavor. Good luck. Oh, that's the plate. <laughs> Wait. Oh. That's a Twizzler. That's definitely a Twizzler. Oh, that's my favorite. Evil. That's my favorite. As soon as I touched it, I knew it was a Twizzler. So you guys are tied. We have, we have a bonus. It's a new product. All right, let's see if this. You can get, you can get one point if you can name the brand. Two points if you can name the brand and the flavor. Oh, what if you just name the flavor? That's yeah, a point. Oh. Mm. All right. The producer. Oh, is it in front of me already? No, no, no. no. I heard Aiden say, "Mmm," so I thought like this is a new special type of candy. Oh, I'd like to buy a vowel. Mm. I know what flavor this is. 
That is white chocolate. No, no. It's was that correct? No. I think this is cookie and cream. Cookies Hershey's. and cream Hershey's. Cookies and cream Hershey's, that's what I said. So cookies and cream, you're both saying the same thing. Mm -hmm. So you both want to get the same amount of points. He Nobody. said something else. He no. said white chocolate. No. Well, cookies and cream it. is white chocolate. Yeah. Well, cookies Anything, and cream. Cookies and cream already exists, so it's not that. It is Hershey's, so you both get a point for Hershey's. What is it? Well, you want to take a guess at the flavor? Oh, wait, uh, okay, yeah. I know it. Is what? it pumpkin? Pumpkin. <laughs> no, wait, no. Pumpkin. Pumpkin spice. I'm afraid it's sugar cookie. Ooh. I hate this company. Do you, wanna, do you want to see the sugar cookie? Yeah. I want a bonus. You know what? There's like it's white chocolate. No, get your goofy little hands off then. <laughs> you just call them. We'll oh. catch you on the next episode of Flavor Fest. Is there a bonus? Like, can we, like, get a no, bonus? No, the segment's <laughs> over. You sure? Yep. Yeah. See ya. Uh -huh. Just a reminder that we are still accepting donations for the homeless veterans. Students can bring their donations to their homeroom teachers. Anybody else who wants to donate can bring their donations to the main office. Click the link in the description for more information. Aiden, what's your favorite Thanksgiving food? Rolls. It's actually ham. But enough about us. Let's see what you guys had to say. For this week's Panther Picks. <laughs> Will, what is your favorite Thanksgiving food? So, I don't like my food. So Chicken wings? Okay. Brynn, what's your favorite Thanksgiving food? Bro, don't just hear me out. Rolls, they hit different. Honestly, like you just need to understand. Mm -hmm. Just, yeah. I agree. Yeah. <laughs> Mr. Grid, what's your favorite Thanksgiving food? I would say super cheesy macaroni and cheese. Yum. Miss Tilly, what's your favorite Thanksgiving food? I make some amazing green beans. What's your favorite Thanksgiving food? I like turkey. Turkey. What is your favorite Thanksgiving food? Stuffing. Parker, what's your favorite Thanksgiving food? My mom don't know how to cook, so probably McDonald's. What's your favorite Thanksgiving food? Food. Rolls. 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 So what is your favorite Thanksgiving food? I would prefer the turkey because I like turkey. What's your favorite Thanksgiving food? Pizza. Avalie, what's your favorite Thanksgiving food? Turkey. Jasmine, what's your favorite Thanksgiving food? Green beans. <laughs> so what is your favorite Thanksgiving food? Mashed potatoes. That's great. Molly, what's your favorite Thanksgiving food? Mashed potatoes and gravy. So Zach, what's your favorite Thanksgiving food? Turkey. Leif, what's your favorite Thanksgiving food? Mac and cheese by far. What's your favorite Thanksgiving food? Rolls. Rolls. What's your favorite Thanksgiving food? Probably mashed potatoes. What's your favorite Thanksgiving food? Rolls, bro. What's your favorite Thanksgiving food? Creamy peanut butter. Jace, what is your favorite Thanksgiving food? Rolls. What are you guys' favorite Thanksgiving food? Turkey. Ham. <laughs> Miss Matthews, what's your favorite Thanksgiving food? Macaroni and cheese. Nick, what's your favorite Thanksgiving food? Mac and cheese. So what is your favorite Thanksgiving food? Mashed potatoes. Miss Latif, what's your favorite Thanksgiving food? I really like stuffing. What's your favorite Thanksgiving food? Homemade mac and cheese. What is your favorite Thanksgiving food? Rolls with butter. Kian, what's your favorite Thanksgiving food? Eggnog. What's your favorite Thanksgiving food? Corn pudding or rolls? Jace, what's your favorite Thanksgiving food? Uh, turkey. Calissa's brother, what's your favorite Thanksgiving food? Ham. Blaney, what's your favorite Thanksgiving food? Rolls. <laughs> what's your favorite Thanksgiving food? Stuffing. What is your favorite Thanksgiving food, Xavier? Rolls. No, it's ham. Where's your problem? Uh, it's rolls, dude. It's ham. No, it's, it's rolls. Ham. It's ham. It's rolls. You're short. No, so it's ham. You. It's ham. It's rolls. All right, guys, shake hands. Ham. Rolls. Sandwich. Fair point.
Okay. Well, that's our episode. Make sure to like, subscribe, and follow on all of our socials. Out Milton Middle School. And remember, go, go Panthers! Panthers! Tell them about what they've been... Mm-hmm. <laughs> So, I like my meals. Gum so <laughs> It's giving foods. It's giving foods. Sophia, what's your fa favorite? Oh. The carving. No. That's a lot of feet.